that when I seen Atlanta and seen all them buildings, I said, damn, you know, it was crazy to see that. It was like a city to me because I had never seen a city like that other than Chicago. That's a lie. I've been, been to Chicago a million times, but I was in Atlanta. Atlanta was, mm -hmm. I thought Atlanta was Hollywood back in the day. Mm. When it freak nicking them stuff, like people mm. was moving to Atlanta like they was going down there to blow up. Mm -hmm. I moved to Atlanta instead of going to New York, L.A. Man, I seen this city, man, and we was riding and she said, you know what? I can't take you down there. She said, you can come and stay with me, but you got to stay in the basement. My husband go to work. He works second shift, 3 to 11. You can't come out of the basement till after 3. I'm down in that basement like Anne Frank. You remember how Anne Frank was with them Germans and shit up there hiding in the yeah. attic? Man, I'm down in the basement, man. So he and didn't know you was living in the house? Didn't know that I was staying in that house. I stayed in, stayed down there for about 20 days. Man, one day he didn't go to work. Mm -hmm. We late. I come up out the, I swear to God, I come up out the, out the basement with a bowl of cereal and my drawers <laughs> on. This old around and look, his name was Sidney. He turned around and looked at me and said, what you doing in my <laughs> And man, I sit down and talked to him, told him who I was, because he called Janet. Yeah. I said, I'm Janet's nephew. And blah, blah, blah. He called her, right? He called, because she worked for the city too. He called her at the job. He said, who is this nigga? And she told him, and I sit down and told 